Where does gorgeous girls use HMBC cosmetic concealers? Ciao bellissimi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, my name is Bright, or you can call me Blessing if you like. And if you're a returning subscriber, hello. It's been a while, I know. I have been loving doing my makeup recently, especially like with new products that I've gotten and tested out. So I guess we're just gonna see. And also I have new concealers and new bronzer that I bought and I really, really love and a new primer as well. So I'm excited to show you guys um, how it looks on my face because that's basically what you're here for, in it? Okay, so firstly, we're gonna start off with primer. So, I'm gonna be using the new e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. This is like the dupe for the milk primer. I really like how tacky this is and how it holds my makeup. The next thing that I love and I recently got is the Collection Gorgeous Glow Filter Finish um, Primer and Illuminator. Literally, everybody has been raving about this and I really wanted to try it. And obviously, it's like a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury. I've been loving using this as my foundation, literally. So I got this in the shade Tan 4. And I'll just literally apply it like this onto my skin just blend it in i thought it was gonna be a bit too light or i thought it was not gonna do anything but then i tried it out the the few days after i bought it and i could literally like see how it's evening out my complexion like literally and it's like my perfect shade which i love i feel like recently because i've been doing like makeup for like a few years now i've been getting like my right shade like straight like i don't even have to search too long like i look at the color or the shade of a product and i can immediately tell which one is gonna suit me and uh, i feel like i'm literally at the top game of makeup right now but yeah i love even the finishing like it just gives me like a really really nice glow bear in mind i do have a ring light so maybe that one you know emphasize a little bit more but i do like how it's evening out my complexion is my shade and it gives me like a really really nice base to work with okay so the next thing that i got was the two new well they're not new but they're new to me these are the hmb cosmetic um soft focus airbrush concealers so i got these two and the bronzer as like a bundle with uh, tammy clark or makeup by tammy with them i really like the concealer so oh people have been saying that you know a little goes a like a long way i don't know why i thought like that wasn't the case but it was the case one time i literally do i did like you know the normal like lift um concealing trick and oh my days that was so much concealer i didn't even need but this is well so now i just literally just dot it here and here here a little bit on my nose literally the tiniest bit that's literally how much you need here so this is my concealer placement and i let it dry while well, that is it so it gives me the most coverage i'm just gonna do my brows and talk about my life really basically now i'm in third year of university and i'm studying pharmaceutical and cosmetic science or pcs for short and um last um i think a few days ago yeah i was walking with my friends and we were talking about you know first day of school like this year how everybody was dressed up and i can't lie to you i literally did the whole shebang like i wore makeup i dressed up really well because it was like my last first day of school as soon as i said that phrase i was like that's when it hit me like this is my last time being in education like this is literally my last year i don't have to study anymore unless i want to do a master's or a phd I'm not sure if i want to do that but i'm still thinking about it but it, i just clocked like bro i don't have to do this ever again like from may onwards next year from may next year onwards like i don't have to be in education anymore which is so crazy because it's like my entire life i've been going to school learning studying doing exams and then you know the whole cycle repeats through the school stages so from primary to secondary to high school to university and i'm just like what the flip 
by the way i'm using the um ps31 brow from primark in the shade dark brown they even the writing even came off now that's how much i love using it i want to try a new brow product if you guys have any recommendation obviously comment down below i really really want to document it as well like the things that i do um here uni i moved into a new place i don't know if i can tell but yeah if you do want a room to obviously let me know it's quite it's bigger than m my previous place um all the three years of my university i've lived in a studio because i just like my space and i don't want people to be stealing my food uh, because then we're actually gonna be in trouble everybody knows like everybody in my life knows that me and food are like this so if anyone touches my food you're literally like even finishing please um i even need to get a new one bro now it's time for me to blend out my concealer so i use this prep and perfect from primark uh, mattifying setting mist i went like this i want to get oh my friend also got me the urban decay all night so this is really really nice to keep my makeup on staying matte as well all day but i only use it for special occasions you know but since they just like filming i'm not even going actually yes i'm going to the library to study with my friend i love this concealer actually the um hmb cosmetic one like i love how it doesn't really crease in my under my eyes can we just like appreciate how quick this concealer blend all right this gorgeous girls use hmbc cosmetic concealers i didn't even tell you the shade so the shade that i got for this concealer is sf for w and then i got this other concealer the darker one in sf6c and um i tried the darker one and i tried it as a bronzer because i think because it's a bundle with makeup by tammy obviously she like she puts out her own shades in it so i i tried this but it was a bit too cool tone for my skin tone and a bit light yeah a bit light so i'm gonna use this as a cream eyeshadow i used it the other day and it was so so nice maybe i will do it today as well so now i'm gonna set my concealer with the revolution luxury powder and banana this is like an old but goody one i really like this powder but i want to get the huda one because a lot of people have been using it and loving it i've seen it works um yeah so that's the one level. But yeah, I'm gonna try and get up some time soon. I'm gonna put some here. And now I'm gonna set it with the HMBC Cosmetic um, Bronzer. And this is in the shade 08 Dark Tan. I love how you have to push this when it opens. Like, so luxurious. So luxurious. And I just blend it in. I found out yesterday that it's a bit too red for my skin tone um, but I do like it underneath my um, Revolution Glow Splendor Ultra Matte Bronzer in medium dark so I put this one first and then I put this one first you can see the difference just ignore ignore the broken pan and the yeah i love this but you can see the difference between the bronzers this is a bit reddish and this is just like perfect for me so i just mix them now i'm gonna use this as a bronzer just to, so can you see it's quite reddish so i'll just use literally the tiniest amount and then i'll go ahead with my revolution one literally love this Okay, maybe I put too much. Oops. <laughs> and now, and now for the star of the show. Well, not really, but this blush, this blush. I don't know why people are not raving about it because this is amazing. It's also broken. I don't know why they break, bro. Stop breaking. I think they just need to make this a bit stronger. But this blush is literally amazing like literally amazing one tap that's all you need but the, the pigment in this is just a bit crazy to be honest with you and i've just been using it people have been complimenting me on it like oh my gosh i like your blush but it's literally so so love and i love like a orangey pinkish 
type of blush on myself personally so i literally love this blush maybe i went a bit overboard with it but i do love blush like literally like my favorite per product is literally this blush over here i also look at that the pressed um what's it called image thing rose yeah it's so cute it's literally so so cute i need to stop putting this on my face before i will i look like a flipping tomato anyways this is the mua blushed matte blush powder and this is in the shade atomic tangerine like guys it's so pretty it's so pretty for dark skin gals <laughs> When I say drench, I mean drench, and then I let it, oh my gosh, it got into my eye. I let it just dry up a little bit. I go ahead with the banana powder again, and then I press it in. So this is like a two-step type of setting, my makeup. So it lasts the whole day. I just like doing this so that my face literally stays matte as long as possible, because I'm an oily skin girl and I need to stay matte. Now I'm gonna go in with a pressed powder. This is the MUA Pro Base Full Coverage Matte Press Powder in the shade 170. Again, like I picked it out in the shop, I didn't even need to swatch it. I just knew what my shade was and I literally just press it in. Oh my gosh. Ah, what the heck is happening? What's going on today? I take it all the way under my contour to snatch it up. And I do press in motion as well because I don't want to lift my makeup one bit. I want it to be pressed and send my skin and not move. Yeah? And what I would do when I'm out, I would literally like take this, this little brush as well, which is like a smaller taper brush for this. This I use for my um, bronzer. But I use, I take this with me and this as well. So if I want to retouch or like maybe this is my like my day look, but I want to keep the same base for my night look. I would literally like drench my face again with this, let it dry a little bit and just powder everything. So um, I get, I use the Technique Get Gorgeous Bronze or Highlighter. This again, guys, the state of this, I've had this for like so many years now, like, I don't know how many years but i've had this for so long and i i also created my own highlighter like powder highlighter with this as well so most of the products is like gone um i don't know if i should show you this but i'm literally holding it by tape and this is the pan and um this is all gone but there's a bit here yeah guys leave me alone okay don't judge me i know your makeup as well is my, the same state if not worse okay yeah exactly so i spritz my um brush i use this brush over here um with a bit of water and i tap that excess on my hand like this and i take a bit of my um highlighter and coat it on both sides of the brush like this like that and then i twist it or turn it like this and then i literally just put it in my face and voila voila beautiful beautiful and my cutest bow and my chin i guess a little bit not too much okay then the last thing i need to do is mascara i don't feel like putting on lashes today so i'm gonna use the um primark aqua lash mascara this is waterproof with vitamin e okay, so i've done my mascara and everything that did my little beauty marks and enhanced my little mole on my eyebrows which i really like thank you mom um <laughs> well, now on to lips so i used the um primark three and one brow in the shade brown this instead um to line my lip and then today i feel quite um 
fancy so i'm gonna go ahead with the essence long lasting eye pencil in the shade lucky lid i use brow and eye pencil like products for lip liner because they're affordable and they are my shade and i can't find affordable lip liners i mean i should check into the drugstore but i just like using this this is what works for me so I literally darken like the bottom and my um, cut cupid's bow with this. I overline my cupid's bow just a little bit. Not that I need to, I just like the look of it. Okay, calm down. And then I use this Technique Color Max lipstick in the shade Be My Baby. In the middle, you can't even see, sorry. Like that. And then I'm feeling glossy, so I'm going to use the 17 Makeup Lacquer Gloss. And this is in the shade, uh, I know there was two, there was coffee and chocolate. I got the lighter one, it's, it's in the shade coffee. The shade is not on here anymore, but it looks like this. And I love this, I literally love this. Like this reminds me of the um, NYX Bottle Gloss in the shade Paralene. That's literally like my shade and this as well. So I love I love this so much. Oh my god. I feel so pretty. I literally love this. And it smells so nice as well. Like I don't I don't know how to explain the smell. Kind of reminds me of vanilla. I think they have some vanilla in it, but I'm not really sure. But this is literally like the lip combo. Combo that I love. Like most of the time when you see me outside, this is the lip combo that I use. Or I use something else but like similar shade in it. So this is disgusting. But this is what I do whenever I have lipstick and I don't want it to get on my teeth. I do this. with my pinky so and then i have all this product that would have got on my teeth and other one that i know like imagine smiling and there's like red lipstick on your teeth please that could never be me i'm so sorry i mean that's literally the end of my makeup like the makeup routine that i've been loving so far with new products Again, I really love this concealer. This as my normal concealer and this as eyeshadow. Really, really nice. I love this bronzer as well. Even though it's a bit reddish, but I can always mix it with my Revolution one. And I can use this as eyeshadow as well. And then, oh, the primer. Of course, we got a love for matte people or oh, oily skin gals. Yeah, if you want to keep your makeup on the whole day, this one. Perfect. And then I love this from a collection as my foundation. I really, really like this. You know, like, soup, like drugstore products are actually quite good. You know, like, super drug, body care, you know. Tesco, flipping Tesco now. Like, come on. Drugstore products are actually good. Anyways, thank you guys for staying and for watching this video. Thank you guys for, you know, doing my makeup with me. And um, we've reached 100 subscribers and I did not even post for like a few months. Like, God is good. See you in my next video. God bless you. Ciao. I wanna ride.